What's up everybody, welcome back. I'm Cody Snow and you're watching Snow Vision and today in this episode I'm going to show you guys how to cook perch on the stove. Not just one way, but two different ways that you can cook perch on the stove. So let's get started. First thing you're going to need is obviously the fish. So if you don't have any fish, get out there and catch some fish. You can see me catch these fish probably in the last episode. So if you want to Click in this link up here and go back and see how I caught these fish. Go ahead and do that. But other than that, we got some breading for the first part of the episode. You guys can pick your favorite breading, but as you can see, I've got Jimmy's Perch Powder. If anyone watches Terra Morata, you'll know what this is. So uh, go ahead and check that out. Actually, not perch powder, but. I like to start off with that and then I'll mix a couple different things in there besides that. Just what I found out that I like. And you can mix up, try your own stuff, try things out, experiment, a little bit fun, get in there. So I like to mix that up and then of course we've got our perch laid out here on the plate. I like to cut them up into little nuggets. I'll we'll grab a reasonably sized knife to do this with. I just like to them up, cook some easier little pieces. Not super little, but. Kind of into a little bit of nuggets there. should be good and you need to go get yourself some olive oil because remember kids friends don't let friends cook with vegetable oil it's crap okay so we're gonna go ahead and put this in the if we can get it open there we go had to go buy some extra because it ran out Fill it up until you can get your stuff about halfway in there. Whoa, there's a B-roll right there. All right, Do that. Kind of had it already running a little bit. So I like to take my fingers with the water a little bit and see if she's sizzling. And she is. That's good. Go ahead and throw your perch or whatever fish that you've got in your batter. Just want a thin layer on it, unless you don't like fish. And then if you don't like fish, I don't know why you're making fish. Shake it up like that. Get a nice thin layer. This is about what she should look like. That's about what it should look like before you let it in there. Just lay it in there like that. I'll start the second part of this. So you get yourself a couple nice fillets like this. Nothing on them, just like that. This is very simple. This is how I like to do it. I just put a little bit of powder on it. Oops. 
steak. A little bit of pepper, I should say. A little bit of salt. Like that. I'm gonna grab your butter. Drop a little butter in there. Kind of work these and take a nice uh, layer of crust on them. And with the magic of video, this is how we do it. And bam, just like that, we got finished product right here. So, this one we cooked in the olive oil, just a light breading, nice light brown. And then this one we just cooked with butter and a little bit of salt and pepper. So let's go ahead and check these out and see how they taste. Let's start with this one first. Here. Oh yeah, that's good. All right, there she is. Go ahead and check out the breaded version. Oh yeah. All right, well, there you have it. I'm gonna go ahead and finish cooking dinner for the family. If you guys are enjoying these videos I'm putting out, I'd really appreciate it if you hit the like button and subscribe. Go ahead and comment below on how you guys cook your fish and uh, Hopefully you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you.